like a hell cut. What is up guys how you all doing and back at it again with another grand prime videos and yup this rom is bit special to me cause literally i've been using this rom on many other devices such as my u euphoria redmi note 3 and finally the developer has made this rom for this lovely grand prime which is the hexagon version 2.4 so starting from the lock screen you get very nice little font over there there you go there is the normal home screen this is your pixel like launcher if you go to the menu i'm not installed any kind of uge apps or something so there are only the normal apps only the play store has been installed so as you can see audio effects only the icons has been changed and the themes a bit nothing much more browser calculator calendar calendar is sort of a bit themed then you get the snapdragon camera nothing new over here just the normal snap camera as you can see you get the shit ton of options from the snapdragon contacts downloads emails the gallery is a bit different as you can see you get the albums the timeline and the videos and stuff quite nice organized i would love this on a stock android rather than that bullshit google's photos app coming down to the phone nothing just the colors are been changed a bit as you can see on the notification panel the colors are a bit different if you expand it quick settings are just different there is nothing new you can adjust the quick settings you get shit ton of quick settings over here as you can see you can scroll and add and there are some interesting ones such as the screen record caffeine navigation bar application picker which are one of some like developer quick settings but still they are available over here also the colors look very good i mean if this was stock android i wouldn't regret it as you can see the settings has been also themed but it just looks like a bit xperia roms if you have tried a sony phone going to the about phone section as you can see hexagon os very nicely themed android 7.1.1 let's just come to the main part of this rom hexagon os settings the navigation and the status bar navigation we don't care about much because we love our hardware keys hexagon customizer as you can see it's very nicely done you can share google plus their website files facebook heads up notification you can adjust that then you come to the status bar you can adjust the colors and stuff going down to the lock screen control your power menu double tap to sleep for example if i double tap on the status bar there you go device slips this is standard stuff which you get in any other roms such as resurrection remix but this rom doesn't have that much of a bloaty setting such as the resurrection remix like literally it has so many options you might get lost it and you will end up bugging your whole ui in the recent panels you get the normal thing and the omni switch as usual blur ui you can uh, add the blur here to the quick settings and the recent apps for example as you can see blur has been added to the quick settings then you get the panel phone like literally Literally, let me zoom in as you can see panel pawn <laughs> it's nothing that you are thinking of it's just a quick shutter opacity and stuff as you can see you can adjust it as you know i completely bugged it off so i will not suggest you to change that so literally that's why it's called panel pawn because literally it fucks up everything systems extensions you get the app sidebar app cycle pie control as in any other rom system app remover you can remove your stock system apps various shade like literally you can call it a dank rom like various shade panel pawn as you can see volume dialogue timeout there are so various functions i have been added through the virgin school literally i checked the 2.2 it didn't had this thing screenshot type take full screenshot or drag your selection it's like a hidden no good thing let's just try it out as you can see i can select for the screenshot there you go only that thing has been screenshotted it's a hidden feature in android which has been disabled so very nice to see that over there and about it's the same thing again and as you can see for the wallpaper you just get this thing over here for right now the developer will add something so guys thanks for watching this was a short re review of the hexagon os on the grand prime hope you guys enjoyed and if you want more grand prime videos please let me know in the comment section below and see you in the next one peace